affects one in five people dyslexia, but there are currently no state regulations how schools in Missouri should handle students with the disorder. Now some lawmakers want to change that. KOMU8's Taylor Stevens tells us what changes could be in store for schools and students with dyslexia. For first grader Amy Paddock, some words are easier to process than others. Emmy and her sister Maisie are dyslexic. They attend tutoring classes twice a week to help learn techniques that make reading a little easier. Learning differently means we've got to accommodate them so they can have the fullest learning experience as possible. And our, our school should embrace that and be excited that they can figure out how to help these kids better and they, unfortunately some aren't. Many Missouri schools do not currently recognize dyslexia as a learning disability. In those schools, students like Emmy and Maisie can fall behind their peers, which can lead to frustration and discouragement. When they sit in a classroom and they listen to the same instruction that everybody else heard in the classroom, and then the teacher tells you to go ahead and start your assignment, and everybody immediately starts, and you're sitting there going, I don't have a clue what to do. Some Missouri lawmakers are looking to change how schools handle dyslexia in students. These three bills are making their way through the Capitol that call for statewide school regulations on dyslexia. Two of these bills call for public schools to screen students for dyslexia and other related disorders. And although mandatory screening is only the first step, tutors say it's an important one. It will change that child's life because then you're going to give them the kind of screening or the kind of um, accommodations and instruction that they need to be successful and then they don't have to face years of failure before they get help. Ban. Ban. Kooten Cooler says mandatory accommodations for students with dyslexia should be the next step for schools. In the meantime, she'll keep tutoring students like Emmy and Maisie one word at a time. School. Taylor Stevens, KOMU 8 News, Jefferson City. Another bill making its way through the House would create a task force on dyslexia. The task force would make recommendations to the governor and others about matters concerning the disorder.